What's up guys, it's your boy Pokemon again today I'm going to be showcasing my Zodiac deck against my opponent's Marincess Frog deck. Um, I think this deck is actually pretty competitively viable currently. It just runs a lot of hand traps and gets you into some beefy monsters. Um, it's got some other sauce in it that I haven't showcased yet, so I want to keep it on the down low because I'm glad that it didn't show up in this duel. But uh, if you guys want to see that deck profile, uh, just leave a like and a comment saying you know that you want to see it. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into this replay. So it starts out with my opponent. I uh, chose for them to go first. So he summons Swap Frog. I Ash it. He sends it back to the hand. And uh, he summons it again, sending his Ronin. Specialing Ronin and summoning Totally Awesome. So he then uses, during my standby phase, Totally Awesome's effect to get Swap Frog out. Um, I summon Whiptail and attack over his Swap Frog. And then I activate 10 key, adding Thoroughblade. I use Zodiac Barrage and I called by his toad when he tries to stop it. So then I attempt to use it and he goes to Ghost Ogre it and then he impermanences it when I go to call by his, uh, his Ghost Ogre. So I just summon Borbo and end. So then he goes ahead and goes into his Marincess full combo. Uh, I don't have anything that can stop him at this point. Um, so I just let him go ahead and I, I actually haven't used this deck before, the Marincess deck. Um, I think it's really interesting and, uh, you know, they, they get into some pretty beefy monsters. Um, but unfortunately they become unable to be destroyed by card effect, I think, and by battle. Um, but then I was hoping for a Twin Twisters here so I could destroy his field spell. But, uh, cause I knew that I could go into a really large monster and get rid of it. Um... But yeah, uh, I, I bring out a pretty large monster, and I messed up by not bringing out Borbo to attack directly, um, which was really dumb, and <laughs> that's not the only time that I do that either. Uh, if I, had I done it originally, I would have definitely won this duel, um, and it's unfortunate that I didn't, because I miss it here again. I make this huge monster in a Zodiac deck, freaking, it would have been, like what, 8,500 attack now, and uh, he brings it down by uh, using, what's his name, Borlo Dragon's effect. But yeah, unfortunately I would have won this duel had I just gone into my Borbos, but uh, sadly I didn't, and I lose here. But, I mean, I think that this Zodiac deck does pretty well, and uh, I'm embarrassed to show that I did misplay here, but, hey, uh, I think it was a pretty good duel. I really enjoyed myself in this duel, um, minus the misplays, but still, that's part of the game. It's part of... I, I just... I don't have any excuse for actually doing that misplay, or those two misplays that were the same one, but uh, I just need to get pl used to playing Zodiac again. And, uh, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more duels like this. Or if you want to see my Zodiac deck profile, uh, just leave a comment down below. That being said, thank you very much for watching and have a wonderful day.